Hello and welcome to Low Budget Gaming and welcome to a short discussion type video and I wanted to discuss why sometimes it's better to wait for games especially AAA games rather than buying them uh, soon after launch not only do you get a cheaper game but you also get a better game so I wanted to talk about Middle Earth Shadow 4 and today they have announced a definitive version of the game so we now have a definitive edition of the game and this will include everything so uh, up until now they had three versions of the game they had a standard game which was $60 they had a silver edition which was 80 and a gold edition which was 100 so basically this definitive edition is going to replace the gold edition which was $100 and it will be priced at 60 so you will be paying the amount for the standard edition but I would still recommend you pick it up on sale now this game came out uh, last year in October 10th of October and I have covered this game extensively on my channel like made several videos talking about this because this was the game that I was looking forward to last year this was my main game that because I loved the first game and I was really looking forward to it but when they announced it I was a little annoyed and I made a, a few videos uh, talking about it as well so I'll just quickly mention that because see this is my first video I made this on the 2nd of March 2017 and this is when they announced the game and it finally got a store uh, steam page etc and you can see the prices here the standard edition was uh, 4000 rupees so about 60 dollars pre-purchase the silver edition with was 5000 so about 60 and then we had the gold edition which was uh, 7000 so a hundred dollars so you can see the hundred dollar version is now a lot lot cheaper the other thing that happened was um, basically what I had predicted was they would release a complete version a game of the year edition which is the definitive edition now and then by winter sale 2018 this year i was expecting it to drop under 30 or so after sales so that was my target of picking this up but the good thing that happened was not only did they release a definitive edition uh, they also removed the microtransactions the loot boxes which was the main reason i was pissed off so this is another video that i made on the 12th of october and in this one i predicted that they would make a definitive edition i mean obviously it's not a big deal to predict something like that but what i did not expect was them to remove the loot boxes so uh, because the loot boxes were getting in the way of the story progression because a lot of people could spend money get like the fancy orcs and stuff and that would sort of uh, destroy the immersion the flow the progression basically and at that time they the excuse they made was that uh, people some people don't have time so they can pay to progress basically so anyway also the other thing is like if you are in india you are going to save even more money because what they did at the time was they now you know some games have regional pricing a lot of games in fact a few companies don't follow the regional pricing model on steam so companies like activision bethesda so the game will cost exactly the same if it was in the us or in india most other places, most other publishers, they tend to do that. So Warner Brothers, what they did with the launch version of the game was they did not do that as I showed you. The game was $100. But now with the definitive edition, they are going to follow the regional model. So the price difference is huge. So look at this. This is the definitive edition at $1149. Remember in my other video, this was 7000 for the gold edition. So you are almost saving seven times like you were paying seven times more for this and imagine putting a 50 percent discount on this so this would be down to five six hundred rupees seven thousand to five six hundred in a little over a year less than a year at this point if, if they put a sale next month it's less than a year so i'm just trying to highlight this point that sometimes with certain triple a games it makes more sense to just wait not only do you get the cheaper game you also get a better game without microtransactions without things blocking your progress and of course with bug fixes and all those things as well so i'm quite happy to see this definitive edition i'm hoping to see a good sale at some point soon and i'll definitely pick this up because now it's worth it so yeah thank you for watching and i'll see you in the next one